Hello there, it's Lynn the Leather Bag Lady uh, here to give you a little bit of information on another beautiful bag that I have uh, listed uh, on my Etsy store. Um, this is an Italian made leather bucket bag from the 80s. Uh, it's a beautiful bag, uh, two tone obviously as you can see we've got the really nice patina brown and the black. It is a drawstring bucket with a adjustable uh, shoulder or crossbody strap. Unfortunately, I haven't been able to find out uh, much about this bag. Uh, I did try. It, it is a good quality bag. You'll find when uh, bags have uh, details such as you know a hang tag here that has the the brand Cerucci stamped on the metal. All the grommets have Cerucci. The snaps on the handles, on the drawstring, yeah, the hang tag here has uh, uh, the word Cerucci on it. Um, so really, really surprised that I wasn't able to find anything out about this bag. But c'est la vie. It's uh, still a beautiful bag. Uh, it's got a little add-on uh, uh, saddle stitched piece here with the Cerucci logo on it also. Internally, it has... Um, it has a zippered uh, pocket right here. It's kind of dark. I don't think you can see it. And the lining is a, a leather, a leather lining as well. No uh, phone pockets or anything like that in there. But remember, this is from the 80s. Uh, we did not have phones back then. You called somebody and or wrote them a letter. That that's uh, we didn't have all that technology back then. Uh, the strap drop is a 21 inch drop from uh, the apex here to the actual body of the bag. Somebody unfortunately has uh, angled, or at least they angled, it looks a little cleaner when you, if you're going to cut a strap to cut in on the bias. But it has uh, taken a couple of uh, holes away. But 21 inches is still a decent drop. Uh, shoulder wise it's a great drop and the trend right now is for a higher sitting crossbody so not necessarily low on the hip kind of between the hip and the breast line right in that kidney area and this bag would uh, would definitely sit nicely there it has a little side pocket which is definitely deep enough to I don't know if you get a phone in it but you'll definitely get some keys uh, Kleenex, you know, lipstick, a uh, couple of bucks, credit card, whatever you reach for, um, you know, quickly and, and, and regularly. So um, has a great, just a great look. Uh, you, you, you don't have any doubt that it's a vintage piece. Just the, the two-tone coloring is, is very uh, identifiable. Uh, my Etsy store is Leather Bag Lady 1. Um, I have about 220, 230 listings, and these are all items that are 20 years or older. That's Etsy's uh, guideline for what they consider vintage, and uh, lots of beautiful, beautiful bags. All of my bags are leather, or there will be a combination of fabric and leather, so nothing you see on there will be vinyl or uh, vegan leather which I do not understand vegan leather it's plastic and let's face it if we're going to consider our future footprint or our ecological footprint this will eventually break down plastic will not so I really personally don't understand the whole vegan leather trend to me it's rubbish but anyway that's just my personal opinion um, Next time I will have another bag for you, another beautiful vintage bag. Again, if you are interested in checking out some of the items I have available for sale, Etsy, Leather Bag Lady 1. And other than that, have a great day and I'll be back with you soon to highlight another beautiful vintage bag. Take care.